Good morning, everyone. Welcome to today's vlog. I just got to work, so I'm gonna make this pretty brief, but I work from 6.30 to 3 today. If you're new to my channel and you don't know who I am, my name is Julia. I'm a CT and MRI technologist, and I work at a clinic. This is my lifestyle channel, so I show bits and pieces from an entire day of my life, not just work. So if you guys have seen vlogs in the past where I've shown bits and pieces of my day, I'm gonna continue to do that on my lunch breaks and whatnot, like showing you guys the scanners, and whatever but obviously I can't vlog while I'm actually with patients and while I'm busy working. I'm gonna go get CT started and do the air calibration because it's Monday morning and then I'm going to get the phantom started and do the SNR this morning for MRI. I had a bit of a chaotic morning, so I didn't vlog much. I probably won't see you guys until lunch, so I just wanted to check in. Also, I'll show you guys my scrubs of the day. I always wear my Patagonia. I think I got this thing in like 2016, and it's still going strong. And then my scrubs are from Janu. I like to wear the jogger scrubs, and then my sneakers are from Adidas. Happy Monday. <laughs> I just got on lunch, it's 11.24. I am going to just go get a coffee and then I actually have lunch here. It's just like a frozen meal, so I'm gonna have that and a banana. I'm trying to be a lot better with eating healthier, so here I am going to get an unhealthy drink. I am actually gonna go to Solid Core tonight at 5.30. I have been liking going to Solid Core just to get a little bit more like muscle toning workouts because I do a lot of spin. So of course I took a little break from YouTube as a lot of you guys may know and probably going to incorporate a lot more like lifestyle, fitness, health related content on my channel just because I am trying to get into a better headspace, a better routine. I'm actually going to do an update video about like why I took a break, where I've been, things that have changed my life, just all of that kind of stuff. There's been a lot of changes recently so I wanted to do kind of an update video so that will be coming soon. Anyway, I'm gonna get my Starbucks and go back to work. Hi. Thank you. Yeah, but you like a straw. No, that's okay. Thanks. You too. So I just got off of work and I ran home and just changed. I am going to solid core tonight so I wanted to put on my workout outfit because I have to run to the grocery store super fast and then go and pick up Winnie. Here's the workout fit. Lulu, a line tank, and a line shorts fanny pack of course and I'm just wearing my new balances which I'll show you guys. I think I've shown them in a video before. They just look like this. Oh my goodness, it is so hot out, but I went to Aldi, got some groceries. So Monday is obviously the start of a new week and I wanted to start off on the right foot this week and get some healthier options to eat. And I found some good recipes on TikTok and Pinterest that I'm going to give a try. So I'm just gonna take everything out and then I'll just show you guys what I got. I'll show you the recipes that I have planned out. I made like a whole note in my phone, but I got some sweet corn, great northern beans, garbanzo beans, black beans. This is my favorite from Aldi. It's the dill dip. Reduced fat feta. This is a pineapple mango Vita Life. No idea what that is, but we're trying it. Eggs, a couple things of tomatoes, 
garlic, white wine vinegar, green beans, little mini peppers, avocados, jalapenos, romaine hearts, cucumbers, broccoli, mini naan, blackberries, and limes. This week's grocery haul was $43. I also wanted bananas, but they didn't have any. And I wanted to buy some chicken, but it was a little questionable there. So this is the haul, and I just need to pick up those other two things from either the actual grocery store or like Target Grocery. So I'm gonna put all this away. So I have a solid core in about an hour, so I'm just gonna have one of these over easy protein bars. I know it says a breakfast bar, but I really like these. I might just have half of it because I don't want to be like super full and then have dinner once I'm done with class. So I just got done with solid core and the sky is terrifying behind me. I'm literally convincing myself that I'm seeing them rotate. So I'm back home at my apartment and Winnie is eating some dinner. She was so exhausted when I came home from my workout class. She was just like passed out on the floor by my dad. If you're new here and you don't really know the dynamic of my living situation, I have a one bedroom apartment with Winnie. And then also we spend a lot of time at my parents' house because my brother watches her a lot during the day for like doggy daycare. And then she also does go to like a traditional doggy daycare about two times a week. I really like to give her the time at daycare to socialize with other dogs, socialize with other humans, and just get time away from us just to kind of eliminate any like separation anxiety she may have. Um, she's definitely getting a lot better, but she has a lot of issues potting on leashes. She does go pee on her walks now. She still has a few issues going number two on a leash, so we're still working on it. Progress, she literally just turned one. She's still a baby. You still a baby, aren't you? That workout at Solid Core was so difficult. My legs are so sore. It was outer glute and tricep focused, but it was a whole body workout. I'm still terrible at it, and I'm on workout number three. It's probably gonna take me about 10 workouts to finally like get into the swimming things, but every single time I go, I feel so sore after. I was getting really stagnant with my spin progress, like I wasn't seeing any results. I was just not in a good mental spot for a while and I decided to take a break from social media just in general and kind of regroup. Please ignore the pimples on my face, I'm going through it right now. It's really hard to be 26 years old and still experiencing this, um, I'm just really going through a hard time with my skin. So. Please be gentle. But I found this recipe on TikTok. Um, it's from The Healthy Hophead. I'll link it down below. And she's been bothering me a I just woke up from a nap and it's 10 30. Oops. Good 
morning everyone happy tuesday so i work from eight to five today and that's it it's all my plans i have nothing else on the agenda today which is kind of nice probably gonna edit tonight spend some time with winnie um i'm very very sore from my solid core class like my glutes are so sore but anyway i'm gonna clock in and get to work hope you have a great day really confused person to the left of me and <laughs> I'm really unsure what he's doing <laughs> Poor little girl was so sick after her spay, so they gave her some wet dog food to hopefully like get her to eat something. That was a long time ago, but I still have a bunch left over because they literally give me 24 cans. So, you hungry? Are you hungry, girly? Uh oh, someone in your water. always so exhausted after work all I want to do is plop my butt on the couch or in bed and take a nap very bad habit but I am so tired also my body is very very sore from solid core yesterday like, I'm gonna rest here for a little bit and then Winnie and I are gonna go on a walk it's a typical evening for us we truly don't do much We tend to play with our toys. <laughs> You're so cute. Kisses. Thank you. That was a wet one. Good. Thanks for putting that toy away. Oh, okay. Oh, your giraffe. You love your giraffe. Always playing tug with everything and then we rip the limbs off of things unintentionally. Whoa. creature of habit and I'm having the same thing that I had yesterday that's okay you have the same thing every day right I can too 
You have a little mustache. Winnie and I got back from our walk just a little bit ago and now I'm gonna shower and get ready for bed. But I wanted to show you guys a few products that Maylist gifted me. This is the Be Tight Lift and Firm Buttox Mask. They're like a skincare brand, but I think they primarily sell things for the glutes. Then this is the Be Thick Booty Enhancing Mask. And the Get Cheeky Enriched Cellulite Oil. And this is what I'm so excited about and this is what I wanted to mention because I'm going to use it in the shower here. This is like a booty gua sha. I do use an actual gua sha on my cheeks, my jawline, and my neck. But this one is primarily for cellulite and the butt. That was so kind of them to send these products over. I'll link everything below if you guys want to give anything a try. But I'm going to use this cellulite oil on my legs and my glutes today after my shower. And then I'm gonna let Winnie out one last time and get to bed. I work at eight again tomorrow, so it's gonna be nice to sleep in a little bit. Hi everyone, welcome to the Hot Mess Express. So I went to spin immediately after work at 5.30 and it was a really good class. Sarah is one of my favorite instructors if you guys are in this area and wanna give spin a try. I love Sarah, she's the best. I'm actually with my mom right now. We're at this place called Mahana Fresh and I ordered to go, but it's like a little bit of a healthier option for pickup. We got some little grain bowls and we're gonna have those. I do need to do some studying tonight for MRI. I'm officially set in the clinical aspect to take my board, so now I just need to finish my structured education, which I'm just doing modules from ASRT. So I'll explain all of that later, but Yes, that was a really big step this week. I finished documenting all of my 125 repetitions, so that's great. I am so hungry. I can't wait to eat this. Enjoy Whitney. There's like no good place to put my camera in my car. Um, I guess I'm gonna put it over here. 
I just got to work. It is 8.20. I'm going to be the later shift today because my coworker asked me to switch. I was supposed to be the 7.30. So I switched with him and I worked till 5. I dropped Whitney off at daycare this morning. I'm always flying by the seat of my pants in the mornings and it's just how it goes. So bear with me as I get back into the swing of vlogging. And Winnie's also in like the heart of her shed right now. She's shedding so badly. Literally this girl gets hair everywhere. Oh my God. Including myself. I shed terribly too, but let's go to work. that was a shit show and my apartment is a mess so I originally started when the Sun was beautiful shining bright into my apartment golden hour sunset got the best clips moved on to the dark look and my TikTok deleted all of my footage deleted also I bought this new ring light which I still have on I have it linked in my Amazon storefront if any of you are interested, I think I'm going to make dinner and then shower. Also, this winged liner look is insane. Something that I would never do if I was actually like going somewhere, but it was supposed to be like a theme from the light side to the dark side, so I wanted a darker themed vibe. I'm going to so. switch back to the hoops that I wear on a daily basis, which I just got these new ones. I just got these new ones from Ana Luisa. I say Anna because it's A-N-A, -A, but I've heard people say Anna, but I had a friend in elementary school and we called her Anna and she spelled it A-N-A. -A. I personally spell Anna A-N-N-A, -N -N -A, so that's why I say Anna Luisa, but anyway, these are the hoops that I've been wearing on a daily basis. So if you guys know, I'm an MRI tech and all of my jewelry has to be titanium or gold or silver. It can't be a metal that is magnetic. Otherwise my earrings pull when I go into the magnet and that's not good. This is not sponsored. I literally love them. My two cartilage ones up here are from Ana Luisa and then the one in my rook is a titanium piece from, I think it's Maison Miru. I'll link it down below. And then the ones on this side are all from my piercing shop. Oh, also the biggest update of them all. My bestie Chaney moved away. She moved to Arizona, so she is hours and hours and miles and miles away from me. She is so much closer to my best friend Brittany, who I met through YouTube. At least I can go see the two of them when I visit, but so sad, but I'm so happy for her. So just addressing why you won't really see Chaney anymore or hear me talk about her, because she literally lives on the other side of the country. So, okay, I'm gonna eat something. <laughs> show you guys what scrubs i'm wearing today these are infinity by cherokee and i got new shoes last night so these came in the mail they're from on running i don't really have an opinion yet if i like them or not because i've only been wearing them for like 15 minutes but i dropped winnie off this morning at daycare for a half day because we're going to that wedding tonight 
This is what the MRI looks like. That's the cervical spine coil. Yeah. Turn the blanket warmer on. Target to get an order pickup and then I needed to get a wedding card so I picked all of that up and finally found one of these freaking cutie cuffs why why can I get this open it's squirt he's so cute if you guys were a kid in the 90s they're basically like snap bracelets but I'm gonna put them in my car somewhere I think I'll put him up here for now until I find a better spot for him. Okay, I'm gonna go home now. <laughs> Forgot my camera battery in the car, but I wanted to show you guys what I got from Target. So I got three of these little poppy prebiotic sodas. I also bought two of these little baskets from the dollar section. They were like $5, I think, a piece. Yeah. And then I got this cute little cart because I have no self-control. Pimple stickers. I got some olives. Oh, and I got cherry limeade. <laughs> I also don't have a tweezer here, so I got a tweezer. Bananas. And then I bought some stuff actually today while I was in there. The wedding card. Some more pens for work. I bought this blue dress possibly to wear to the wedding. I think I'm actually just gonna wear the black one though. 